the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's love. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 29, Exodus 30 to 31. Lighting the incense for prayer. God told the Israelites the procedure of making the altar of incense, the basin and sacred perfume oil, and appointed Bezalel and Oholiab to start to work on the tabernacle. First point. The high priest must start and end his day by burning fragrant incense on the altar. God, through Moses, commanded Aaron to become the high priest whilst they were residing on Mount Sinai. God furthermore told Aaron his two most important roles as the high priest. The first was to burn fragrant incense on the altar, every morning and every evening. The second was to make atonement once a year. An important point about burning the fragrance was to ensure that the high priest did not offer any other incense or burnt offering. Later on, we see how Aaron's two sons, Nadab and Abihu, were put to death by God for offering the long incense. The incense burnt by the high priest was offered to God. Second point, everyone must make an offering to God. During the time on Mount Sinai, God told Moses that the law in a kingdom of priests was to make sure that everyone made an atonement offering to God. They were to offer to God their atonement money to thank God for giving them their lives. Whether someone was rich or poor, they were expected to offer atonement money. All those over the age of 20 were expected to do this. This atonement money from the Israelites was to be used for the service in the tent of meeting. Similar to the atonement money, something called temple offering existed in the New Testament that Jesus was made to pay via Peter. Third point, creation of the world and Jesus' cross were God's solo project, but the ark, tabernacle, and the Jerusalem temple were a collaborative project between God and humans. God created the universe all by himself. And for Jesus, although he spent three years with his disciples, he took the cross all by himself. But God gave Noah the design for the ark. God also gave the design for the tabernacle, which was to be made collaboratively between him and the Israelites. As it can be learned, God takes pleasure in working together with humans. Fourth point. The leaders of Exodus were Moses and Aaron, and the leaders for building the tabernacle were Bezalel and Oholiab. The leaders of Exodus were Moses and Aaron. The leaders for building the tabernacle, however, were Bezalel and Oholiab. The reason they were selected to undertake this job was due to their wisdom. They had the ability to research during the process of making, and after their job was done, they did not touch it ever again. After the tabernacle was complete, no one apart from the core sites were allowed to touch the contents inside it. Bezalel and Oholiab made the tabernacle from beginning to end but even they were not allowed to touch it after completion. Fifth point, Sabbath, God's plan for humans is to walk for six days and to rest on the seventh. God commanded humans to keep Sabbath. The purpose of Sabbath is for us to reflect on God's 
our Creator. God said, "But the seventh day is a Sabbath to the Lord your God. On it you shall not do any work, neither you nor your son or daughter, nor your male or female servant, nor your ox, your donkey, or any of your animals, nor any foreigner residing in your towns, so that your male and female servants may rest as you do." Remember that you are slaves in Egypt, and that the Lord your God brought you out of there with a mighty hand and an outstretched arm. Therefore, the Lord your God has commanded you to observe the Sabbath day. This Tong Doc app is amazing. When I first met Dr. Zhou, we were speaking together at a conference, and when I saw the Tong Bible and the way he had placed this one story together, the Bible, one story, I ordered cases of this Bible. Now to see this app, the Tong Doc app, ready for you to use in your daily Bibles reading, this is amazing because so many people tell me I don't understand the Bible, and he has placed it in an order. And so that it is one story, and then day after day takes you through the Bible in a way that God's Word will touch your heart so deeply that it changes your beliefs. It helps you to rise up and be the amazing person He created you to be. Welcome to the Tong Dog app.